Jane left over a million across the state in the dark with families having to throw away their refrigerated food that went bad. Tonight, our Josie Frost explains how the Department of Social Services is responding to those who use SNAP benefits. Before, if you wanted to get your SNAP benefits replaced, you had to submit paperwork to DSS to prove that you live in an affected area. But through the mass replacement, if you live in one of 28 eligible counties, you'll automatically get 55% of your September benefits back by Tuesday. That means that there will be no documentation that will be required. That means there will not be a letter required from your power company or your electric utility saying that you experienced an outage. Conley Ann Ragley is with the Department of Social Services. She says without the mass replacement, to get your SNAP benefits replaced, everyone would have to fill out the application. A SNAP household would have to complete an affidavit of loss saying that they lost their food uh, or their items in their home and that they would also have to obtain an individual letter from their utility provider. So if we have 277,000 households in South Carolina that receive SNAP during the month of September, that's a potential of 277,000 individual letters that would have to be generated by uh, local utility providers. DSS says for a county to be eligible for mass replacements, 50% of the population in the entire county had to have experienced a power power outage lasting at least four hours. If you aren't from a county that is eligible for mass replacement, you can still apply for the individual SNAP reimbursement using the online form. Only people who are eligible for SNAP in the month of September can get replacement benefits. But Tiana Super from FEMA says for those with immediate needs after the storm, you can apply for serious needs assistance online or at their hotline. And um, when you answer those questions, you could uh, qualify for the $750 serious needs uh, grants that you can receive to help you get started. Things that you need right now, right? Immediately, like emergency needs. For people who do live in a qualifying county, you can expect to see your SNAP benefits back on your EBT card by Tuesday. And for those whose counties were not eligible, you can still apply for individual SNAP replacements. The deadline for September has been extended to October 26th due to Helene. Reporting State House, Josie Frost, News 19, WLTX.